Hey everybody, welcome to the show. I'm your host Sandman. Today we have a huge announcement from Covert Instruments. They didn't tell me anything. They didn't send out any emails as of yet. Currently it is 1235 Central Standard Time. I am in Austin, Texas. No emails yet whatsoever. Someone just sent me a message on Instagram saying, hey, I check their website daily and this is new. And then someone had posted in my Lock Sport Collectors Facebook group where I try to notify everybody of things before everybody else can buy it out. So if you're looking to get into the news of Lock Sport and want to get on the jump of some of these things, check out the Lock Sport Facebook group, uh, my Lock Sport Collectors group, and the link in the description down below. Anyways, Covert Instruments came out with a new section of their website called The Chop Shop. And it is finally here, the Custom Chop Shop. Welcome to the Chop Shop at Cover Instruments, where craftsmanship meets chaos. Here you will find an unprecedented opportunity to custom build your own kit to spec. Purchase unique small batch sets, replace your favorite broken pick, and buy experimental prototypes of things we are creating. You may even be able to snag a prop from one of our videos. Yes! This is awesome. What is the Chop Shop? Nobody wants to be boring. The Chop Shop is where precision meets rebellion. We're talking. We're taking lock picks and turning them into canvases for artistic expression. Your picks will become the subject of discussion at your next lock sport meetup or social media posting. All right, guys, let's just go ahead and get in this. This is what you can do. You can order every single tool that I can tell from the Echelon, from the Arbiter, from the Genesis pick set. You can order every single tool individually and a few others that are not in those sets. Order them individually, add them to your shopping cart. You can order comb picks like the Ergo comb pick. You can buy Chop Shop Shackle Tags. This is fantastic. You can buy, oh man, you can buy all the cases in different colors. You can buy everything. This is fantastic. This is what I've been waiting a year for. Oh man, this is good. I'm My blood pressure is rising. I got to calm down a little bit. Here's what I really like about it. I want to be able to go in and purchase just my 20,000s pick because that's what I want. I want 20,000s picks without having to buy a $75 lock pick set. Maybe I want a different color case or maybe I want to add just a whatever. I can do whatever I want. That's the great thing. But one thing that is that I, I haven't brought up yet is they're doing the etched lock picks here and we have some new designs, some very cool new designs. So if you want to build your own lock pick set, you don't have to go add things individually. You can go to Chop Shop, build your own pick set and you literally just click on the items that you want and they're automatically added to your pick set. Set. takes a little bit of time for the website to kind of like render I guess or to accept accept it so be a little patient but if you if you click on the item you want it turns blue on the perimeter of it it highlights it in blue if you realize oh I don't want that just click on it again and it'll de highlight that that's how you add and subtract things to your to your shop and if I click on one thing and I go up here it already says four dollars click on another and it calculates at eight dollars this is fantastic this is something I've never seen Seen before on any other website typically you have to go to the individual picks and kind of assimilate your stuff all on your own now man this says everything this is everything this is really great I really love this I I'm so broke right now so I'm not putting in a purchase right now and I'm not using covert instruments on the daily right now I'm using other things but this is what I have been wanting for a very long time so let's go back to those etched pick sets we have a bunch here and we're gonna talk about those here for a couple minutes um, some of these say that they're sold out. I think they're just not ready yet. I don't think they sold out that quickly. There was never even an amount announcement made for these tools. I hope they do etching similar to what they're doing on these lock picks. I hope they provide etching on the ergo combs and on the ergo tur uh, turning tools, the turning tools in general. I think that'd be super cool. But man, I love that. I love that I can go in and get an etched pick set and I can get it in the thickness that I want and I can add it to the case that I want and I can supplement it with more tools how cool would it be if they could find a way to etch some of the bypass tools but the bypass tools are all different thicknesses so we're probably not going to see that anytime soon uh, first off we have the covert instruments emblem with the skull and the bypass tools and the picks in the background it's basically the covert companion um, that's so cool then we also have 
the engraved Genesis pick set here with the, uh, it's like the microchip, whatever it is called. I actually really like this one. This is probably what I'm going to put in mine. I think it's cool. I grew up watching the movies hack, the movie Hackers, and, uh, and I'm the worst with computers. Go figure. Um, and maybe it's because I watched that movie growing up. I thought that's how computers work. They have a dragon here. That's pretty cool. I, listen, they could they could, do, they could put shit on a stick and fucking etch it onto these picks. And it would be better than what these other companies have been putting out for 10 to 15 years. This is innovative. This is fun. This is collectible. This is what I want in my lock sport gear. This is what I want. Everybody's like, Sam, man, why do you shit on Sparrow so much? Well, because Sparrows has been putting out the same garbage since 2010. There's zero innovation there. It's new to you because you're new to lock sport it's not new to me it's all the same old gag i don't like it this is new at some point this may become old but man this is promising this is very promising it's very exciting we have the keyhole here and we have an octopus coming out there that's awesome it's fantastic let's go look at this um we have the uh, game of thrones you know the the throne of swords or whatever but it's all lock picks that's so cool we have the rivet set similar to what you would see on maybe a tank or an airplane from the world war ii uh, time frame and we have a samurai that's super cool i love it with the cherry blossoms it looks like in the background no it's not a cherry blossom it's something else looks like cherry blossoms up here but anyways very very cool i love it, it says sold out it's not sold out it's probably just not ready yet that's very cool. I can't wait to see them come up with more designs. That was the the fault. The failure of Sparrows was that they came up with really cool designs 10 years ago. And they have not come out with any new designs since. Like they should have came out with a new design it, at the very least every single year. Instead, I'm looking at one, two, three, four, five, six, and uh, six individual etched picks from Sparrows. And then there's a set of three that make one image. So we'll just call it seven. Um, but those have been out for like a decade, man. And they just like, yep, we give up, we're done. You know, so it's really great for people that are like, oh, this is cool. But those picks are not practical at all. They're super huge. The profiles are ginormous on them. The pick steel is ginormous. Um, they're not something that you're going to use on a regular basis at all, except for maybe like the Medusa or something like they're just not good. Okay. Uh, the Medusa and the one where she's like doing this, those are pretty cool, but listen, they're old. This is better tool still. 301 high yield stainless steel, 285,000 pounds per square inch of ultimate tension of strength about there. Okay. So this is the strongest tool steel on the market for lock picks to date. And they are now etching them and giving you uh, profiles in 20 thousandths or 25 thousandths while supplies are available in those thicknesses. Right now we're looking at the topographic set sold out in 20 thousandths, but I guarantee that they will get that back in, in stock. This stuff is going to fly off the shelves if they can keep this stuff in stock oh, i love this i love the wave i love japanese art i love this and i want it in 20,000, sir i want it give it to me i'm throwing money at the computer right now and you're not taking it i need to talk to customer service i'm, I'm throwing money and your website's broken why aren't you taking my money all right let's take a look so like i said you go here here's your case let's first pick out our case I've been going with like an every, uh, an OD, excuse me, ah, it's flat dark earth, okay? It's a flat dark earth, coyote brown, desert tan, tactical peanut butter, whatever you want to call it, that's what I've been going with. But let's build this thing sexy. Let's go with the black garrison pick case, all right? And let's pick our patch. Let's go with the chop shop PVC pinning patch, all right? So we are looking at $25. That's it for the both. That's a really good price. I really like these uh, Ergo Turners. I like Top of Keyway Turners. And I like my Precision 2-in-1 Turners. Let's go with... I don't want to put any bypass tools in here. I like having my Arbiter set separately, uh, believe it or not. And because I just like to have all the bypass tools in one case. We are going to add a... Flat hook, well, it's a medium hook and 20 thou, flat hook and 20 thou, and let's go ahead and add our rakes. I don't need rakes and 20 thou. I like my rakes thick, sir. I like them thick and juicy. I like the quad rake here. Let's go with the quint rake and 25 thou. And let's see here. Oh, man, I really want to add bypass tools. I don't need them. I already have them in my Arbiter kit. I just want to go to kit. You know what? All I'm doing is picking one, two, three, four. I don't need these. I'm going to deselect these. Thank you for the awesome feature. 
I'm just going to add this to my set. My set right now is $66. I can add that to my cart. And then I now that that's in my cart, I suspect it's in my cart. Let's see if it's in my cart. Yeah, it's, it's a, it should be in my cart, right? Let's go. Let's add it to my cart again. We can always subtract this quiet this this is a required field. All right, so we're hitting up hitting a, a hiccup here. It says it says picks. Oh, it, you have to add a pick. Okay, we're seeing some problems here. You have to add a pick. See, I was hoping that I could just buy things. So, in order to use this feature, you have to add picks. That's fine. So what I will do is I won't use this feature of Chop Shop Build Your Own Pick Set and I will just select items individually because what I wanted to do was add a laser etched set in 20 thousandths when that becomes available and it's gonna be this circuit board set. I'll just build a whole set, you'll see. You'll see, I'll get it figured out. I'll add the engraved picks, that's because it's an extra cost. So that makes sense. The site's not broken, I'm just learning how to use it. So what I would recommend is pick the tools that you want that are etched, then go build your own set and add whatever bypass tools you need or don't need um, to it and then that's it, move on with your life. That is so cool. God bless you, Covert Instruments. God bless you, Lock Picking Lawyer. Let's go to the vault. Let's see what else is in the vault right now. So the vault now only has eight items. To be fair, we've had eight items in the vault for quite some time, for about a year, but we have a couple items in here new. So the plug spinner is new, and we have the Reaper lockpick set in here that's new. So did something move out of here? Let's take a look at the products. Let's go to all products, and let's go to sort by... And let's go to new to old. See if anything came out of the vault. We have the Jiggler pick set. I need to get that. We have the Warded pick set. I need to get that. And that's it. All right. So nothing came out of the vault. Maybe they discontinued something. I don't know. Uh, maybe they discontinued something that was in the vault. My phone is going off the hook. I was like, Sandman. Ah, Sandman. They got the custom shop. And I'm like, I know. I'm stupid broke right now. I just bought a $2,000 mobility scooter thanks to the help of me friends. And that's where most of my money is going to that and supplements because I'm trying to get healthy. I've been having some heart issues. Bump, bump. So that's all I have for today, folks. Let me know in the comments down below. Are you excited about the Covert Instruments Chop Shop? I am. Man, this is great. I love it. You can go to individual picks. You could just buy all the individual picks. This is fantastic. This is this is what I've been asking for. This is what everybody wants. This was everybody's complaint. This is what I recommend. Fantastic. Fantastic. I love it. Let's see it. Let's see if we can get some more going with the other uh, manufacturers. I have other updates to give to you guys from competitive manufacturers, but I'll put that in the Lock Sport report this Friday. So that way I'm not taken away from Covert Instruments. 15 minutes of fame here of their, their fun in the sun. So that's all I have for today, folks. Let me know in the comments down below. Are you as excited as me or nay? I'll catch you guys next time.